Hi, I'm Anton from Anton's Mindstorms Hacks. In this video I'm showing how to remote control this uh, simple spike prime tank with a uh, Mindstorms EV3 brick. So the, both of them are compatible, at least if they speak Bluetooth. And I'm going to show you how uh, this uh, remote control, this very simple remote control, can control this tank. Let's get to it. And um, now is a good moment to also hit the subscribe button. I have uh, downloaded the program here on um, the EV3 brick through Vir Visual Studio Code. Um, it runs PyBricks, of course, on EV3 dev. And um, here there is no code running, it's just on in the hard mode. Um, you don't need anything else because the EV3 brick is sending commands and doing all the logic um, within the tank here. So what I'm doing here is I'm going to file browser to my project and start the main program. It starts booting. Now is a good time to put this one on the floor and it's also a good time for you to hit the subscribe button. Okay. There we go, it's on the floor. And now we have basically tank controls here. So um, I can start driving backward, forward, turn a nice figure eight um, so this <laughs> the program here is really simple um, there is a program running here that um, forces this uh, motor into a central position back so if I release the stick it moves back and it also transmits the angle of the stick and um, translates that into the power of one of the motors of the tank here so the farther I press it for, uh, forward the more power it um, asks these tank motors to deliver um, how this works is that this brick um, sends micro Python commands over REPL, R-E-P-L, and so this other brick can be passive. It, it just creates a Bluetooth connection, um, stops the telemetry that comes out of there and starts sending commands over all REPL, and there you have it. It's a remote control. I have shared um, all the code for this on my blog and there is also a full tutorial you can follow and see the code, it's all free, the robots are real simple, there are no building instructions but there are, you know, it's just like the simplest possible um, remote control ever and the simplest possible tank ever, you should be able to build something like that yourself. Hey well, thanks for watching. I hope you enjoyed this uh, remote control video. Um, hope to see you again in the next video. And in that video, we will do something uh, more special. In the next video, we'll be using this remote control transmitter to control this rubber band cannon. So it's the other way around. Instead of the EV3 controlling the robot inventor hub, now the robot inventor hub controls the EV3. That works too. Thanks for watching, bye bye, and uh, remember to hit the subscribe button. A nice figure eight.